But you certainly didn't expect to sign off like that, surely? No, I didn't. I, I really didn't. I think, obviously, we knew Penrith would be tough opponents. Um, I think scoring early probably settled us down and sort of put them on the back foot. But I thought we, tonight, I thought the way we played tonight is a, an absolute representation of us. The way we moved the ball, big pitch, suited us down to a tee. But every one of them tonight, I, I, I said to them before the game, make sure that your mentality is right. And you're not coming in here thinking that we can just turn up and it's going to be given to us. We knew Penrith will be up for it, uh, but look, couldn't pass anymore tonight. Uh, there's some wonderful goals. Which was your uh, choice? A lot. Uh, I, the best I, of the lot. I absolutely love Lewis Moores. I think Lewis Moores away he just took it in and just passed it into the top corner. Um, I mean, look, everyone knows what I think of Lewis. I think he's a fantastic young prospect, and I think he's one that's going to keep getting better and better. And over the next few years, I think we'll see a, a real progression in him. I think once he grows into his Sort of his adult body type thing. He has that little bit of a, a growth spurt. I think we'll see a real, uh, a real player inside there. He was in good company tonight, but uh, he certainly shone for the 90. Yeah, I thought he was tremendous. I really did. I think obviously all the young boys that came on. I thought obviously Zach Martin and Zach Lester again coming on and, and playing for the first team. I thought oh, I just said to Terry after well, about 20 minutes. Ago, I, said, I love the way they passed the ball to each other. It just absolutely fired in, and there's no fear with them. Absolutely no fear with them, and, and I can't ask any more from that. Um, and I think, like I said, at the start of this season, we have to build this pathway for these types of lads to come through. Uh, and nights like this is, uh, is really good for them. Well, three of them will be playing on the sheep mount on Saturday, but uh, a great experience for them to play at Brunton Park tonight. Yeah, look, the, the mentality they have, and uh, like I said, you have, I think obviously the longer the game goes on, you're kind of thinking people are saying they're going to take the foot off the gas, but the mentality the boys had. And that's everyone, the young lads as well, when they came on, they've got the mentalities, they want to keep going, they want to keep going, they don't get sloppy. Um, so look, I, I couldn't ask any more tonight. A special night for you, coming back to your old stomping ground, you must have enjoyed it. Yeah, but I did, loved it. I think obviously the, the performance and, and, and the result, and then obviously you, you, it's what we said is that we want to finish the season with silverware, you know what I mean? We've said that we've done the promotion, now let's go and finish it and get a, a bit of silverware in there for the club. Um, I've got a lot of respect for this competition. I've shown that right the way through. I think there's only one game where I've not played a lot of first team players and that was Winscale away. And um, it, it just shows that I do. I want to win this competition. I want I, my first spell here, my first season. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think we were in the final that year. And so, look, it's a competition. I want to win as many times as we can. Uh, man of the match, Obbs. That was another okay. special performance from him. Tremendous performance from him. Uh, and look, he's, he's just doing what we ask him to do. Um, we've told him to give us a headache and make sure that he makes me and give him another opportunity. So he's just got to keep doing that. And I think obviously we've got a conversation to have with all the players now and making sure that we know where we're at. Uh, me and Terry have got a meeting this week where we'll sit down together and go through what we think we need to strengthen, what we think we, um, what we, think we can let go. And then we'll again speak to all the players and see if any of them have got different of opinions of whether they want to stay or whether they want to leave. Yeah. We've scored 100 goals this season, we topped the century mark tonight. But uh, a word of sympathy for Penrith and uh, Edmore? Yeah, look, I, to be honest with you, I didn't really want it to, to end like that. I'd, I'd rather it was a, a really close game, maybe a 2-0 or something like that. But look, I can't, I can't fault the boys, you know what I mean? The, the way they played tonight, the, um, the way they moved the ball and, and things like that. But again, like you say, I do have a lot of sympathy for Penrith. I, I, I've got a lot of time for the football club. It, it's, club that's got a lot of people I've got a lot of respect for and I think highly of and uh, like I say for me I would rather it finish 2-0 but them boys just won it tonight. Danny a wonderful season ended on a winning note tonight thank you very much. Cheers Steve thank you very much.